So let's run through the build real fast. So you're gonna need Necrochasm, and the Catalyst is just gonna make things even better. Your special weapon is whatever you like. I'm trying out this shotgun here. And you can use whatever heavy you like. I'm using a Strand LMG to shoot tangles with, build up my darkness meter if I need to. And importantly, this build needs a piece of armor that has the necrotic effect, whether it's the actual necrotic armor or a Spirit of the Necrotic class item. Now the mods are pretty simple. All I'm doing is using kinetic siphons to generate orbs. I'm using melee based mods to help get my melees back and to generate orbs off of melee kills. And then I have one two finisher to consume all those charges that I made and turn those charges into melee energy. We will be using the prismatic subclass with song of flame. I'm using Phoenix dive arcane needle to get those three melee charges. I'm using cold snap grenades to freeze groups of enemies and make them easier to shatter and do more damage with melees. I'm using feed the void because it's just easy to devour. I'm using lightning surge to slide in and do a bunch of melee damage in an AOE. As for our fragments, we'll be using Facet of Grace. Defeating targets with kinetic weapons grants you bonus transcendence energy. Defeating targets with your super grants you and nearby allies bonus transcendence energy. Facet of Blessing will give us health regeneration with melee final blows. Facet of Ruin will just help us with our stasis grenade and our super. Facet of Dawn will make us radiant more often and give radiant to our allies, though it's not super needed here because we do have radiant orbs in our seasonal artifact. And Facet of Balance just to grant us more energy here and there. And our seasonal artifact is just going to have the standard shield crush and transference mods equipped. Great for transcendence builds that use their abilities. Everything else here is pretty much personal preference. Elemental Siphon is nice. You can generate fire sprites on all these AoE kills. And Threaded Blast is also nice. And honestly, that's all that really needs to be said. Here's some gameplay of the build in action on one of the best obstacle courses for ad clear. If you have all these components, like the Necrochasm, then I recommend you try this out.
I also made the music and I hope you enjoyed it. Okay, thanks. Bye.